Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. This is Donna from Tarot. Tarot to do Second Chance Sunday. Will there be a second chance? Two dice, six decks, six spreads. Let's see what's going to happen. So it's going to be the good tarot, and it's going to be are they worth it? All right. So I've already shuffled everything. Ooh, okay. I've already shuffled everything. So you may be weighing your options on whether or not this person is really your um, wish fulfillment. <laughs> is this somebody you really, really wanted? Is this what you really wanted? All right, so this card represents them, who they are, the three of earth. That's a Capricorn card. Um, somebody who is willing to work on it or somebody who is willing to work together um, or somebody who involves themselves with more than one person. How they see you. Four of air is taking a break. It's like four of swords. Um, that's a Libra card. Um, they see you as like just taking a break. How they feel about the relationship is eight of water, like walking away um, for something more fulfilling. So that's a Pisces card. Something you're ignoring about the problem. The full card is impulsiveness, risk-taking behavior, willing to take a leap of faith, but something that you're ignoring about this person, it could be that they're reckless and impulsive. Maybe a, they're just, they may not be serious. They, they may go through, go through life as if it's just, you know, nothing to be taken seriously. A little too lighthearted. Um, what your relationship is based on, man, he is loud. My neighbor is here doing something in the back with equipment. Um, what the relationship is based on is um, holding back. So has there been a lot of holding back and trying to be strong? Um, the full card is Aquarius card and the strength card is a Leo card. So is, you know, the relationship based on holding back? The future of the relationship, nine of air is like nine of swords, losing sleep over it, being stressed out and losing sleep over it. And I feel like trying to spread your wings in some way. Um, being, you know, losing sleep. That's the future. So a lesson from this is fight for what you want. Stand up for yourself. Five of fire is like, it's also pay attention. I'm going to say this. Pay attention to anybody who seems very drama-like or chaotic. Um, because that's... That's a lesson for you. You want to avoid anybody who's all drama and all chaos. All right. I'm getting distracted. What is he using? Oh, it's a weed eater. All right. In the garden, weed eater. All right. So on the bottom of the deck, five of air, argument, fighting, Five of fire, five of air. I feel like um, Capricorn, you've dealt with somebody who's been who's just been really chaotic. Um, doesn't take things seriously and possibly involves themselves with more than one person at the same time. Um, I heard threesomes in my head. So here's arguing and fighting and chaos. All right, so six cards, Donna's destiny. Um, what did I say? Capricorn. Libra, Pisces, Aquarius, Leo, Gemini, Leo again, and Aquarius again. All right, so, and the sign that their sun, moon, rising, or Venus could be, and or they could be really heavy in this energy as well. Scorpio, all right. So they come across, they could come across as kind of intense, maybe a little controlling. All right. Well, betrayal in the past is affecting your relationship as we in reverse, so that is not the case. And maybe it was, but they let their ego ruin their life as sideways, so maybe they, they realize it. Someone secretly lusts for you. Um, get a reading is sideways, so maybe that's what you're doing right now. <laughs> um, they're afraid of commitment is upright, and you might want to know that. Make them put in more effort as sideways, so maybe that's because that's what you should have done before, but maybe now it's not even worth it. Um, addictions are affecting your relationship is right side up. And I shuffled the shit out of this deck and it keeps coming up for everyone. Addictions are affecting your relationship. That's coming up for everybody. All right.
Capricorn, love you, thank you, and I will see you in the next one.